I'm Marcus Scribner and I'm from Los Angeles, California. When I was growing up, I was always super quiet, super shy. I was into school. I loved reading books. I, I became inspired uh, to be an actor when I was around the age of seven, I think. I was into reading books, stories, characters, and I was really just trying to find a hobby along with my parents um, where I could relate to something like that. So I tried out all the like sports and everything like that. Then I just settled upon acting. And the first day of acting class, it was a holiday acting class, so everybody was giving out presents. I was like, I want to be an actor forever if I get presents like this. So I just ended up, I kept doing it and I really enjoyed it. And we took the next step, got an agent. Bada boom, here we are. <laughs> the NAACP Image Award goes to... Black <laughs> I do have a platform that I'm able to reach uh, thousands of people from and uh, hopefully inspire them to do better in their own communities because it doesn't uh, it doesn't take that much work to um, better the lives of someone else or to make this world a safer place. I think our generation has a lot of power being that we grew up with technology um, and we know our way around the internet and how to spread a message like wildfires. I think Emma Gonzalez right now, what she is doing with the uh, March for Our Lives movement, I mean she started this entire campaign that is sweeping the nation if not the world right now and it's demanding change. So I wanted to get involved um, in any way that I could so I created um, this sign that I think has a very powerful um, message because it really puts everything into perspective. There were 40 gunshots in the amount of time that you could read the entire thing. Like that's insane to me, the fact that um, we're allowing weapons like this to be purchased by basically anyone with minimal background checks. I think it's important that people know that you don't have to be famous to make a difference. You can make change in your own community, whether it's starting up a community garden or um, helping the homeless. I feel like everybody can take small steps um, to bring about greater change. I'm finishing up high school right now, second semester of my senior year. I've got a lot of college admissions letters back. I got into Pepperdine, UCLA, and USC, and I feel like education um, is something that my family has always valued, especially my mother has instilled in me. It's definitely important to um, try and, and expand your horizons when it comes to what you enjoy to do. You can find a passion in something that you have fun with and maybe turn that into even a career. So I think the most important thing though, um, in my opinion, is to never give up believing in yourself. It sounds super corny, but I feel like that is what has definitely um, kept me going along with the support of my parents is to make sure that I'm always like, no, I can do this, um, I can continue. Because for a long time, I said I was acting since I was around seven years old. It took me seven years before I booked something big, like Blackish. As long as you keep going and you keep pursuing the dream that you have, you have to put in the work before you uh, reap the benefits. I'm Marcus Scribner, and you're so beautiful now. <laughs>